today we're making a beautiful wire wrapped heart shaped crystal our little crystal heart that I've got here is about four centimeters wide and four centimeters tall it's about one centimeter wide and it's thickest part so it is sort of a thin crystal and we're using the 18 gauge black wire today this one is not a really a super soft wire it's a little bit harder to bend but I just really like the black contrast against the light crystal so we're going to use about 14 inches of the 18 gauge wire today and we just start by finding the middle so just sort of gently bending it slowly in the middle then we're going to start to form the bale so I just use my round nose pliers and grab it there in the middle and then wrap it around the round nose pliers so you can take your pliers out and grab it in a different position as well and we're just going to wrap it around so it's got two loops there to form a nice strong bale I find the easiest way of doing this part is to actually hold it with your round nose pliers we're holding the bale there and we're going to just start twisting our wires down with your wires sort of held apart and you're just twisting them around each other making sure that you're not just twisting one wire around the other wire you're actually twisting both wires equally you want them to be nice and tight as well for this size crystal here I do about eight or nine twists or half twists I guess they are you can sort of check it up against your crystal as well and we want the bale to be sort of sitting sideways on the crystal so that when you hang it with the chain it's going to sit nicely so I've just turned my bale to sit sideways we want our twist to come down to about the middle of the crystal so that it sits sort of symmetrically and also your two wires coming down are going to hold your crystal nice and securely just keep checking it up against your crystal so that you can get them all into the right position you want your wrap to be as secure as it possibly can be and on the heart you've got the two sides and the top so we need to have equal pressure around each side and the top and that will hold your heart securely in place when you've twisted down far enough we're just going to hold the wire on there and just with your pliers bend the bale over the top of the crystal so that when you're holding your crystal on the side the bale is sitting across the center of the crystal At this point you can use a little bit of tape to sort of hold your wire wrap in place if you find that easier. This is not the dead soft wire so it's a little bit more challenging to bend but I just find to work on the other side it's easier if this side is held in place. Now we can bend these bottom two wires around the other side of the crystal. So we're just bringing them around the back to be in the same position as they were on the front and meeting up so we can start our twists. You want those twists to start about the centre of the crystal again just to match the other side. The goal is to just align the back with the front as well so trying to get the same amount of twists and have them nice and tight so that it holds your crystal nice and securely in place. You can use your pliers to help with the twists as well if that's easier. Hopefully you're going to have about the same amount of twists as you have on the other side or close enough to it will look okay as well. When you've twisted it up high enough that it's meeting up with the bale, we just bring one piece of the wire on each side of the bale there and pull them nice and tight so that your whole wrap is going to be nice and tight. Then we can bring the first wire around the bottom of the bale, just bringing it around two times to hold it nice and secure and then cut the little tail off and crimp it down nice and tight. Breathe. 
then we can bring the other wire around the bottom of the bale as well covering up that first piece nice and tight and securing that bale in place cutting that tail off and crimping it down nice and tight So you should have a nice secure little wire rack right there now and you can take your pliers and just check all your wires over. You can take your tape off now as well and just check your bale that the loops are together and straight and that all your wires are sitting nice and symmetrically and how you like them. Now you can pop it on a chain or some twine and enjoy your wire at Crystal Heart.